going to begin our evening with a special memorial tribute to three members of our school, three very close friends we lost in the past year. The first memorial tribute is for Doris Christian. Be remembered. Please turn your attention to the video presentation. A community is really a conglomerate of all the individuals who are part of that community. And each person brings something that none of them can. In our school, Doris Kushner, who along with her husband Bernie, was one of the founding members of the school, brought something so vital and so important. Her presence brought with it a simple faith a great love of life and Judaism, and a great love and trust in God that is something we can all learn from and strive to emulate. Doris passed away as Hanukkah was beginning, and I mentioned at Leviah that Doris' life epitomized Hanukkah, because Hanukkah was really about Jews who knew what was right and good, standing up for what was right and good, despite the world against them, and despite great odds against their ability to ascend. Doris, in her final fight, faced the odds and so strong, she was far more than her final fight. Because Doris, in those last few weeks, was really a reflection of Doris in her whole life. Sweetness, a quiet grace, a greatness, a simple faith, a love of her weekly sheer, a love of her to heal what she kept at her side, and in sickness and in health, the love of her family, the love and support she gave to the community, and the greatness of the Jewish woman. Doris epitomized the Asia's Chayo, the woman of valor, as Shlomo Mel describes in the Mishlein, one in whom her husband can trust, her family can have faith, and on whom the community can rely. She was a woman of faith, of strength, of commitment, of quiet greatness. It's my hope that as we recall her tonight and beyond, that we can emulate her ways and follow her footsteps. So 
going to read the inscription on the plaque presented to Bernie Kushner in memory of your beloved wife and our dear friend, Doris Kushner, who in her quiet and unassuming way did chesed without fanfare. She lived her life with complete and simple faith, leaving us all a legacy of pure Torah values. Congregation-based Torah, May 7, 2017.